Each boat comes equipped with everything needed to cruise the waterways. One of the useful items you'll come across are the detailed waterways guides or cruising maps. You'll find these on board when you arrive or they can also be purchased before your trip. They include exact locations and distances between locks, any rules applicable to the area and useful information about your destinations. Usefully, they are marked with kilometre points which will allow you to plan each day's cruising. When cruising at a leisurely 6 kilometres an hour, 4 to 5 hours is usually far enough for a pleasant day's journey. During your induction, you'll be shown that a couple of rope tricks will make your life simpler. You are likely to come across cleats. Securing a boat to one of these is simply a case of taking one full turn around the base of the cleat, then taking it over and around each arm. By twisting the loop under itself and passing it round one arm, the rope will jam against itself and never become loose. The benefit of this is that even when wet, it will be easy to undo by hand. Throwing rope is a skill you'll gain very easily. The secret is to split the rope into two separate coils. Hold around three coils in your throwing hand, take a generous loop between and hold the rest of the rope coiled in your other hand. Toss the coils in your throwing hand under arm, then immediately release the rest of the coils from your other hand. You'll be amazed at how soon this becomes second nature. Apart from ropes, there is another indispensable piece of kit, the boat hook. This can be used for manoeuvring, guiding mooring lines, pulling up the anchor, not to mention fishing things out of the water.